Yo, 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 what is up, everybody? We are back with another edition of TFTC Sports Week 12 Picks. Man, this season has been flying by, and guys, Thanksgiving is on Thursday, and we got some football. But without further ado, I am your host, Real Good Doty. And it's your boy, man, Kodak Coughlin, man. You already know we got the picks. You know you're the best sports station out of here, man. I got my other calls with me. Chico Grande, Chico two times, a.k.a. Shooter McGavin, baby, a.k.a. Shooter. Thank the Lord. You know what I'm thankful for this what? Thanksgiving? What are you thankful for? Matt Canada getting mother effing can. Matt Canada, you're out of a job. You can get the hey, now, F now, out of Pittsburgh. Now, check this out, guys. It's, it's never, I mean, you should never really glorify someone losing their job. Fact, I'm doing it fact. today. But sometimes you can't help it, though, if they're part of the problem. True. But, they were the whole problem. Before we get started, guys, problem. make sure you go to the App Store and download Mother Effin' Price Picks, okay? It is football season. Ooh. We got basketball, even MMA. So if you want to go ahead and just do a little mix of football, NBA, or maybe some uh, MMA. But this week, I got this week's matchups for y'all. But make sure to download the app Price Picks. Use promo code P-R-A-W-W-P. QJ4. Price picks will match your first deposit up to $25. Also, they do promotions, Taco Tuesday, when stats are discounted, and even Flex Friday, where you can put down $20 and then and then the next day they'll reimburse you. But download the app price picks. But for this week's picks, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna select David Montgomery over 75, 75 and a half rushing yards. Uh -huh. Then Jamar Gibbs over 45 and a half rushing yards Dak Prescott over 275 Jared Goff over 23 and a half pass completions that's and easy then last but not least your boy C-Mac over 33 and a half receiving yards I mean 49ers I mean they're looking really really good and C-Mac I mean he can do it not only on the ground but also in the receiving especially against Seattle I mean they own Seattle and plus Geno Smith might not even be playing so I mean McCaffrey's definitely gonna hit this now Jared Goff kind of worries me a little bit because think about it they're going against Green Bay Packers and then I mean Detroit man they got that two-headed monster like with Gibbs and David Montgomery who literally bro Every time David Montgomery has missed games, mm -hmm. the game he comes back, he balls. I mean, balls. that offensive line is amazing. I mean, that, that I mean, I mean, the thing about Detroit, they can they can not only run but pass. But I mean, I just I'm very confident in their um, <clears throat> props this week. Dak, I mean, they play the Commanders. I definitely expect Dak to hit that. But guys, make sure you download Price Picks. Use promo code. Without further ado, we're going to get started. And without further ado. Without further ado, to kick it off, right, when you're making the extra stuffing and all that other stuff. You love that to, stuff. When you're trying to finally uh, finish, uh, you know, preparing the, the meal and everything, uh -huh. you can turn on a little TV at 11.35. We got the 4-6 and six Green Bay Packers going against the 8-2 and two Detroit Lions. I mean, the Detroit Lions... I mean, Detroit. It wasn't too like too many years ago that they uh -huh. were just like one of the worst teams or well, worst team in the NFL, and it's Facts. amazing how Dan Campbell, what he has done to that team, like that whole city, they believe. Now I'm not we saying believe. the Detroit Lions are gonna win a Super Bowl, but they look really good, okay? And they and they've gotten better. That's the thing; they're getting better each and every year. So, the thing about that is going against a team that's the opposite that's uh -huh. a clear rebuild you, you think so I mean? because aaron jones got hurt mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and he mm -hmm. hasn't i mean he's been hurt this whole season and true i wouldn't be surprised if they let him go at the end of the year or tell him to take a pay cut um also i mean aj dylan's not the guy clearly um christian watson i mean they had there's a one who basically um drafted him because uh -huh. they got rid of Devonte adams so he's supposed to be that guy hold now, on wait wait wait, wait. Did, didn't we didn't we just beat the chargers okay we, 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 we won that's a different that's a different story we though. won yeah you trashing the, the lions crashing the up. lions beat the Chargers. i got on a pack as the lions beat the chargers because you're flip-flop supreme what 
Lions beat the Chargers, my guy. The Lions beat the Chargers. Yeah, the week before they beat them. And well, and the Packers beat the Chargers too. Okay, and, yeah, the Chargers. And we throw no pick. The Chargers, they lose games they should win. Anyways, let me finish my question. Uh, uh -huh. So with that being said, I I just feel like Detroit overall is a better team. I mean, they beat them pretty bad in their home at the beginning of the year. The Lions have gotten better. Green Bay has not gotten better. The um, I just I, I don't see Green Bay winning this game, especially with the tight end Musgrave. That's probably not going to play because he um, is in the hospital for uh -huh. abdominal issues. Uh, injury, yeah. Um, Air, um, what's it, Aaron? Uh, uh, what's his name? Um, Aaron Jones. Aaron Jones? Yeah, Aaron Jones is out too as well. Um, so I, I got lines in this game. What? I yeah, I mean, that's an easy pick. That's an easy pick. Jared Goff just threw three picks. He, they barely squeezed out against Chicago. Chicago. And yeah. they're going to squeeze it all over Green That's Bay. That's a divisional game, though, Come man. Come on, man. Embarrassing. Weird, hey, the Lions are favored by seven and a half. Because y'all don't know anything. Come on now. Jordan Love out here. Prove you wrong. 322 last game. Two you touchdowns. Bet straight up? Come on now. That's up. You want to bet straight up? You want to show your pack of pride? That the Packers going to beat uh, the I bet you. I bet you three more dinners. Three more? Yeah, finna three dinners? What? No, I'm not doing three. I'm, I'm just, just doing this straight up. To take some of my dinners. Hold on, hold on. Let me let me keep going. Let me land. Let me land. Cause y'all try y'all trying to Green Bay like they ain't trying. Like they just giving up. Like they in rebuild mode. No, that's you not talking, what I'm saying. You, 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 can, you can hold on. You can rebuild and be competitive. Uh huh. But what I'm saying is they're in a clear rebuild and uh -huh. they're just not as talented as the Detroit Lions. I'm sorry. Oh, you know what Lord. else they can rebuild? Detroit Lions did good one year and all y'all's on the bandwagon. I just don't understand. They got it, better man. last year. They're good last year too. Nah. They barely missed the playoffs. And then the year before, they finished strong. They're going to finish real Never strong. Ever since then, they've been mm. getting better, man. They, and this is the first time that Jordan Luck had the keys to the Lambo, so let him drive that thing. He doing decent right now. He, he going to get there. They'll give him some more topics. I mean, Rom Romeo died back here balling. I mean, he need a better running back. Like you said, A.J. Dillon, he ain't doing what he need to do. He, he's not. He's so, not. He's not the guy. So, exactly. But the defense is stepping up there. I mean, like, if Jared Goff coming out here throwing three, this is not the Bears. Off he can't all. come. He can't come out here treating the, the Green Bay Packers like the Bears because he will lose. But I mean, enough about all that. It's time to put your bets in. I'm going Detroit Lions this game. They finna smash the Green Bay Packers. You can go okay. get yeah. get punched in the face right now. <laughs> you, thought, you thought I was going the Green Bay? No, I already knew you were doing this from the jump. I was just waiting for you to get off your high horse and stop playing with us. Yeah, I already knew it. I knew he was captain. You he's, know that. You know he's a I cap rapper. I had the Green Bay Packers. You know we got faith. You know he faith. don't live his raps. We got faith, man. You don't on. live but his guys, raps. Guys, he let us flops. know. Let us know how much the Detroit Lions are going to win by. Okay, and let us know. For the next matchup, we're going to go to the 330 game. Uh -huh. Four and seven Washington Commandos. Um, <laughs> Commando. <laughs> seven and three Dallas Cowboys. Now, the uh, Commanders, I mean. Washington, baby. The Commanders clearly let my New York Giants win. and um, Embarrassing game. Y'all chalk the script, guys. Y'all just don't want us to get a good draft pick. I get it. Cowboys, I understand. Cowboys are understand. favored by 11. You want to get Ron Rivera fired? I get it. I understand. I mean, Sam Howell, that last interception was like, come on, dude. Like, come what on. He sold. But hey, my New York Giants got a dub. But the Dallas Cowboys, 7-3. and three, I mean, they beat the brakes out of the Carolina Panthers. I mean, Bryce Young's clearly not the guy. But I mean, like I said, Cowboys can beat up against bum teams. I mean, that's, that's been their pretty, schedule. That's, that's this what year. it is. But this game is a divisional. I mean, what what what's gonna happen? I mean, honestly, Cowboys are supposed to win this game, but I mean, hey, Commanders can just go out there and just be really competitive with them. I can see. I mean, honestly, I can honestly see the Cowboys messing up and cowboying this game up and here's, just losing. But here's the thing, though. It's real possible. I don't think they're really good in divisional games. Here's the thing, though. If a report comes out saying that if they lose this game, Ron Rivera is on the hot seat. Let's see how that commander's team reacts. Because if they come out and they play competitive, mm -hmm. then, you know, you, you can be like, all right, well, then at least they made it competitive. But if they don't and they just get whooped and it looks like they're not even trying, then clearly that team has quit. And that might have been the case last week against the Giants. That Sam Howe interception mm -hmm. was very sketchy. I'm sorry. If you go back and look um, at it, just um, that was just 
a it was just meant. It was just meant. For, it was meant for the Giants to win that game. Right. They, they had nine sacks that game against no, the Giants, and, and they I still lost. I, I, Sack I, I it understand. Up. I mean, and they had nine sacks, and I'm, I'm saying it was sketchy, sketchy. But anyways, um, we'll see what Commanders team comes out. We, I mean, it looks like at the beginning of the year they're playing good, and now it's like they don't care. They don't give a fuck. I'm, I, I mean, excuse my language, but that's what it seems like. God, true. I mean, honestly, I mean, I'm honestly. just, I'm just tired of the Cowboys in this easy schedule. Y'all have had yeah. back to back to back weeks. Y'all played the Panthers. They, just I played, feel like they played a team with the losing the Giants, record. Played the Giants for like, like five weeks control. in a row. Now you playing Washington. Y'all finna smash Washington. Like y'all just playing. It's just right now they but have things the are gonna get into, hey, Things are gonna hey, get interesting. But they're not gonna be battle. The Dolphins. They're not gonna be hey, battle tested when they make the playoffs. Hey, they're playing the Dolphins. Very soon, the Bills. Very soon, I mean, we're gonna see. We gotta see. I mean, but that's later on. We gotta see about the Bills. I still don't buy them. But anyways, guys, let us know who you think's gonna win this game. I'm going with the Cowboys. What you got? I'm uh, picking the Cowboys, but I hate them. Even I though I want the command, even though they, I want the Commanders to honestly win. Um, but I'm, I'm, uh, I be, I, I'm gonna go with the Cowboys. I'm gonna risk it. I'm going out there, man. I'm going out with a limb. I'm picking the Commanders, man. Yes, I risked it last week. I risked you it last week, and I won a whole it? bunch of games. What do you you want to bet on it? Don't bet we on it. Bet. We can bet. Don't bet on the Commanders. You're gonna learn the hard way. I, I, did you know I won? I won my double bet. All right. What are you talking You're about? The hard way. Right. The hard way. Straight bet up. Him, bet we, him. We know we gotta bet this game. Lock just, it in. We gotta lock it in. I'm not Cowboys doing, Nation. I'm not doing any points. This is the only this, time that's right. Just like I have face hey, with the, hey, the hey, facts. Hey, I'm telling you, if you're gonna see about the commanders, if they're uh-huh. gonna go out, I they're gonna be competitive, or they're not gonna give a crap. I can I'm see telling that. You, you're gonna see it, a team. You'll see. We gotta see what's going on. I mean, I feel like they're gonna be extra, extra hype. Uh, we, but we gonna see. But moving on, I got commanders. These two people got a cowboy. I, mean, I, I don't like the cowboys. I hate but the cowboys. They've been, they've been, That's what I'm picking in this po- game. We gotta see if Dak Prescott hey, shows up. Hey, cowboys tip, have been good for my pockets. I'll tip my hat to the cowboys if they give me a free margarita. So I tip my hat to the guy. But I mean, they gotta step up. I mean. They still don't got no weapons out there. Tony Poll- Tony Pollins, he all right. He's gonna, he's, he, he's gonna. And by the way, guys, Pollard's rushing this game. Saquon eight, Pollard. Either that fantasy score. I mean, Washington is terrible against running backs. I mean, the the week before, uh, they played us. Kenneth Walker had a day. Every every running back eats against the Commanders, guys. So um, they got Tony Pollard's rushing, receiving, whatever fantasy. What Take I mean. It. They get, uh, true that. I mean, it is. And CD Lamb receptions or targets this game. Make sure you Dak get up. Dak is gonna feed him. I like that. I'm telling you, Dak's gonna have a good game. We gonna we gonna see. We gonna as long hope. as he doesn't Dak it up. Uh, we gonna see. I hope the Cowboy it up. But moving on. I would like a ne- shootout, by the way. I'd like a shootout. Oh, Zach's not winning no shootout. Shooter Zach said is that not ain't winning no shootout. no shootout. He can, he barely hit 200. He even hit 200 passing yards against the Panthers. Are we done with this game? Yes. Anyways, guys, the next matchup. This this. Is what I was waiting for. The seven and three, San Francisco 49ers going against the six and four Seattle Seahawks. Now, the Seattle Seahawks, I mean, I understand Geno Smith got hurt. He left the game, but you guys let me down, man. Like, you know, y'all sold my coin, man, and I'm just going to have to ban you. And unfortunately, in this game, guys, you're playing your big brother, and you're going to get waxed. CMC. Receiving whatever you can get. Christian McCaffrey, take him. George Kittle, expect him to have a big game. George Kittle's been on fire. I mean, Brock Purdy's finally going to George Kittle. And guys, Purdy. this is why I drafted George Kittle in my fantasy to stack him with TJ Hawkinson, that double tight end stack. And then my run game is sick. But, I mean, they've been really leaning on George Kittle, man. And George Kittle is just, he's a machine. Debo, I mean, he hasn't. I mean, he's still there, but Ayuk's really the one that's been taking over, guys. And I just got, I got the 49ers in this game. 49ers More are than favored seven. by seven. Are favored by seven. Mm-hmm. Actually, I, I just, I got them just straight up to win this game. I'm gonna go. You don't even got them by seven. You, you, wouldn't even seven? Get, you wouldn't even get the Seahawks seven. Depends if Geno Smith plays or not. Yeah, that's hey, a good one. I'm, I'm going 49 this game just because I don't know if Geno Smith's gonna play. I mean, I got faith in him and everything. I mean, even if Geno played, I got Niners though, dog. Nah, Geno playing, I got if Geno was playing, he was full, okay. it was healthy. I, I go Seahawks. No, man. man, because 49ers are better coach. That's what it comes down to. All right, 
Geno, Geno Smith has, has been proven. Guys, let, and guys, a proven winner. And guys, let us know who else you like in this game. Player props. If you like DJ DK Metcalf, Tyler Lockett. Um, oh yeah, Questionable. Kenneth, Kenneth, uh, Kenneth Walker is not playing, by the way. Questionable. Hey, Kenneth Walker is mm. not playing. Dang it. Geno Smith is questionable. And, I will, and then Kenneth Walker is not playing. Everybody on the 49 is playing. Oh, I was about to say. Ooh, it's a lot of people. But I mean, I mean the way it's looking, the way uh, I mean the Seahawks barely lost against the Rams. That was a crazy game. I can't believe that happened. But with this, this is gonna be a good game. I'm going 49ers. You going 49ers? 49ers. So all three of us going 49ers this game. All right, moving on to the next game here. We got the who we got. Ooh. Seven and three on Friday. Yes, on Black Friday. Our first, I believe, first Black Friday football game. The seven and three Miami That's Dolphins funny. going against the four and six um, New York Jets. Now, the New York Jets, I mean, they've been, they've lost, what, two in a row? Yep. Um, in games that are actually winnable games for them. Not so much last week, but the game prior to that. Um, but Zach Wilson was benched. I don't even know who's the starting quarterback, but I mean, Miami. I mean, they did their thing. I know Tyreek left the game, but he should be back for this game. Now, I mean, it doesn't matter who Tyreek goes against. I mean, he's going to go against Sauce Gardner, but I mean, Tyreek Hill, man, that dude's just a machine. He's the best receiver in football. Dolphins are um, favored by 10. I mean, this is, this is, a, this is a evil. I would say that Jets cover. You think so? But I, what? Yeah, because that new quarterback. That quarterback is first, that quarterback can do nothing. They're gonna play harder for him than Zach Wilson. Was, Zach Wilson not even was to be the quarterback, the starting I know, quarterback. Exactly. Game. They got the new quarterback, and plus Aaron Rodgers is trying to make a comeback. But anyways, guys, I got I got Miami winning this game. Oh, what's his uh, Tim Boyle? Yeah, Tim Boyle. I got Miami winning this game though. Uh, I got. I mean, of course, you know Miami's gonna blow out. This, you know, win this game yeah, by a blowout. I just don't know if they're covering. They gonna beat them more. They gonna, you never know. They're not gonna quarter. They're not gonna cover. I mean, hey, you never know. Hey, hey, Jesse, you should bet Seth on this one and take the Jets plus ten. No, I'm not taking the Jets. Jets gonna lose by not, more than ten. They gonna lose by more than ten. I already know that. Oh, okay. The Jets is trash. They couldn't do anything. They couldn't stop on? nothing you against the no Bills. Faith and Boyle? No, it's not. No, it's the defense. The hey, defense can hey, stop but, nobody. Hey, even though the Bills won, Jay, I don't trust them though. The bet on them though. Who the Bills? No, I learned. I, my I gotta lesson. see. What they, I gotta see. I gotta see what, later on who the Bills lesson, playing. Dude, I learned my but I mean, with this game, I gotta go with Miami Dolphins. They finna win this for well, sure. That's the for only show. Black Friday game. Yeah, it's only yeah. Black Friday Which game. Which is weird. I don't understand. Like, why wouldn't they make it a little later? Yeah, I mean, people at two o'clock. I mean, except for like the old heads. For real football, football like fanatics are gonna watch that game, especially that matchup. But anyways, guys, next matchup we got our Sunday games at noon. Um, the five and New five Orleans Saints. Saints, the five and five New Orleans Saints going against the four and six, four and six mm -hmm. Atlanta Falcons. I mean, this game I don't care about this game. Michael Thomas is on IR next. He's gonna miss the next four games. Saints are favored by one. Uh, I don't. Um, Jameis Winston, baby. Jameis Winston finna ball out. Wait, 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 who's the favorite? Uh, New Orleans. Even though, I mean. Uh, New Orleans is going to win because uh, Jameis will. Jameis Winston. Winston playing, yeah. Jameis Winston and, you know, Alvin Kamara. From, Alvin Kamara, of course. He finna show he had seven catches for 33 yards. I mean, even though they lost against the Vikings, uh, the last game they played. This game, I can see them winning. Uh, what, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna. I hate not, the. I hate the Saints. They, I, hate I mean, they them, both, both these teams coming off a loss. But uh, I'm gonna go for uh, Winston. Exactly. I mean, it's just not looking yeah, good. Yeah, I, I like. I, I I got the Saints in this game. I just need to. Know, I just need to know what the Falcons are doing with their quarterback situation. Like Tyler Heineke. Like I remember Taylor Heineke. Taylor Heineke. Like Heine. he ain't. He ain't the guy. I mean, then who? who that bad. um, Desmond Ritter. Yeah. He's Andrew. How long he's out for? The season? I don't know. I didn't see anything about. It. And being injured. So why is he? Is it bench him already? Mm -hmm. Pull up the go injury go. list. Hmm? Injury list for this one. Let's see what we got going on here. I mean, B.J. Robinson. I mean, he he has been showing. He has been Bajan Robinson. He has been showing up. Twenty-two for Here's ninety-five. The list. Let's see what we got. Scroll down. Let me see the Falcons looking for um, the quarterback. What happened to? Him? Michael Thomas is doubtful. Derek Carr has a concussion. Yeah. Marcus Latimer, go down. Ankles questionable. I mean, dude, Latimer. 
Michael <sighs> Thomas, I mean, he was he's not a bad player. He's just he's just trying this to move on. Oh, look, yeah, look, here it is. Hamstring. Mm. I really wouldn't bet on this game, but honestly, I think the Saints are going to win. I'm going Saints. Saints. Yeah. All three of us going Saints. Yeah, Saints. Confident. Now, this game, this this is going to be Ooh. possibly for the division. You got the 7-3 and three Jacksonville Jaguars looking to get revenge against the 6-4 and four Houston Texans. Now, no one thought the Houston the Texans were going to be this good. Uh -huh. Everyone thought the Jags was going to be this good, and the Jags... Have a good record, but the thing about it is they've had a little bit of an easy schedule, and I have yet to see the Jags. The only good, te the only convincing win that I've seen them do was Buffalo. Believe it or not, but uh -huh. it, but it was, I mean, at a neutral playing field, and plus, um, the Jag, I mean, the uh, Bills, I mean, McDermott didn't take that game serious. They underestimated the Jags, to be honest with you. I mean, they sent them out there on Friday, two days before the game, to get settled in. Like, that's ridiculous. But anyways, guys, get back on topic. I mean, the Jacksonville Jaguars steamrolled against the Tennessee Titans. And then the Houston Texans went ahead and um, beat the Arizona Cardinals. The Jags are looking to get revenge, though, because earlier in the season, the, uh, the Jags ended up losing to the Texans at home. I mean, that was just a, a, a pathetic loss. I mean, for the Jaguars, that was a really bad loss for them. But they're favored by they one back. and a half. But here's the thing, though. I haven't really seen the Jags really beat anybody though. I mean, they they barely beat the the Saints. Uh huh. I just honestly. So you said so you said I you want to you want to bet this game? Is that what you're saying? I'm going Texans. I'm, I'm going, going, going Texans. Jags. I'm going Jags. Man, stop playing, man. You, you already know. What you say, Kevin? I'm picking Texans as well. What? Oh, you that one double bet? Y'all both want to lose? Let me stop. Let me stop. I don't want to get too ahead this of game, myself. This game's gonna be. This, Do I got the faith in Stroud? I mean, he's I mean, all right. I mean, I mean, Trevor Lawrence is looking to get revenge, though. Exactly. That was 37 17 last time. He's been, it's, it's not, not going to be like last like time. That. It's not going to be like It's going to be a shootout. CJ, they was. Like, honest, they, we, know, we knew what C, we didn't know what CJ was bringing out. Now we know what he's coming with. So we're going to cover that up. He, he, had, he threw three picks last game. He ain't, he ain't finna throw three picks and win to get, beat the Jags. You throw you throw in picks, you're going to lose the game. You throw in picks, you're not scoring in the red zone. You're going to lose. You can't do that. You can't do that against the Jaguars. You got lucky this against the Cardinals. Game. Here's the thing, though, man. I mean, even if the ja even if the Cardinal, I mean, the Jags win this game, still, we still number one in the in, no, no, in the no, AFC no, no, South. But, but people still aren't gonna really fear the Jags, though, because the Texans are still kind of in a rebuild. Oh, here you are. Oh, my God. Just being honest. I'm telling so, you what it is. So, you're happy when they win. Hey, they're amazing. Right, no. But when we beat them, oh, they in the rebuild. Y'all supposed to win. Nah. What did they do against the Chiefs? It's what the happened? Chiefs. Hey, the Texans smoked happened, us this though? year, man. They embarrassed us, so I can't say Still nothing. Still, that was, a, yeah, that was. We a played like game. we have like these games. We just don't. And it's show gonna up. be interesting when the Broncos play the if the Broncos play the Jags this year. That's gonna be interesting too. Broncos country. That's right. That's gonna be interesting, especially if they play in the playoffs. But anyways, guys, I mean, this honestly is a, a coin toss. I mean, it could go either or. But I'm gonna go with the uh, Texans. And then what do we got, Seth? Ooh. Six and four, Pittsburgh Steelers going against the five and five Cincinnati Bengals. Bengals don't have their quarterback, man. I mean, that's He's just the thing. They, they put all their stock into Joe Burrow, which is Burrow's fine, Dunskies. but you got to have a backup, and I don't think they have that backup. But we'll see. But honestly, Pittsburgh should win this game. As long as the uh, picket, I want to call it picket. I've had faith in you this whole year, and you just keep on showing that you may not be that guy. And it's it's really disappointing because mm -hmm. I thought Pickett had the gusto, I thought he had the maneuvers, but I mean, hopefully Canada's out of there. Thank God that they'll be able to get going. I mean, Warren was the only thing going for us. Uh, he had that touchdown. It was like a what, like a seventy-four yard touchdown. That and that's like pretty much like how we got our only touchdown. Mm -hmm. You know, the defense did their job. They held him to thirteen points. We can't score more than ten. The, like I mean, it's ridiculous, I man. Only got one we, sack. The play calling was so dumb. It was mm -hmm. like the dumbest thing I've ever seen. And like Canada should have been fired. Hopefully, we, you know, we'll see who's calling the plays now. That we'll get much better play calling that actually makes sense, so that like the offense can get a rhythm, and we're not counting on the defense to score for us to win. 
basically. So you basically, and so you going Steelers in the game, right? Yeah, I'm going yeah. Steelers, of course. Of course, I mean you going Steelers also, because no, I mean basically nobody knows who the court. I mean nobody really knows about the starting quarterback. Honestly, the, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna guess. I got Bengals. You going what? I'm just gonna guess. You know he's, he's not playing. He's out for the okay. Steelers are what? favored by uh, uh, one point. Yeah, I want to yeah, 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 bet. Want to bet on this, sir? <laughs> no. You feeling frisky? I don't like it enough to bet, but I'm what's, it, what's the name of the quarterback? Did, did they give you the name of the, the Bengals backup quarterback that's playing? Uh, let me, let me so see. I mean, only only way they're gonna win is got too Joe, much weapons around. Joe them. Mixon has to ball out. Like Joe Mixon has to do on, on the, the ba- ground. Hey, the Bengals could be in a oh, very said good. Jake, Jake Browning, right? That's Jake, that, Jake that's, Browning. That's who went in that, for him last game. That's who your faith is on, Jake Browning. He went eight of fourteen with sixty-eight yards. It's all right. I mean, Jamar. He uh, had a 94 Jamar passer Chase, rating. Two catches, 12 yards. I mean, I'm going to go with the Bengals. I don't know about that. Uh, of course, luck. you know, Steeler Nation. And no matter what week it is, it's always Steeler Nation. And uh, you know what y'all also need to be doing? Y'all need to sign up for prize picks. Y'all want your money now. Y'all want your money fast. Prize picks. We doing. We doing, we doing all this for y'all. You know, we making these picks. We making these bets. We giving y'all the spread. Y'all better utilize this, but moving on to the next game here. Man, you know what I just, just noticed before we move on? What happened? Warren had uh, uh, nine carries for 129. Balling. And Najee had 12 carries and only got 35. Najee, what are you doing? They, they Warren's need th- a clear-cut guy. How many uh, receiving yards did Najee have, though? Because Najee be catching most, a lot of times. No receiving yards? No receptions? Nah, oh, I man. mean, he had like, what, one, one yard. What? What's going on? I guess they, they giving him more low. I guess it's, they show showing who they're giving him. No, but it's like to. he's still getting more carries. They're kind of made him like, you know, co-starters. Uh-huh. But it's like, I think that Warren should be getting at least 15 attempts. Bring Najee down to like seven or eight. Mm-hmm. 129 against the Browns. That's great. That's, I know. And the Browns have one of the best defenses. Facts, facts, facts. But moving on here, we got the next game, man. We got my guy. Set. Go down. The one and nine, my bad. <laughs> the one and nine, Carolina Panthers against the three and seven Tennessee Titans. I don't care about this game, dude. <laughs> this is what the game kidding? of the century. What do you mean? Century. What are you talking about? This Bryce is the Young? clash of the Titans. Stop playing. We got Bryce Young out here. We got team, Will Levy's. One team, the that, one team that's really one kick, team. that's kick, kicking themselves because... Uh-huh. Well, they had the chance to get C.J. Stroud. Titans are favored by three and a half. Bryce Young instead, and another team. They don't know if Will Levis is the guy. I mean, so, of course he's not. I mean, he's not gonna be. He should be the both guy. Both franchises are kind of fucked. <laughs> I give you that. I mean, they, they need to do something with Derrick Henry. I mean, that's the only. That's the only thing I can really see they can trade. Basically trade him. Get Basically something. trade him. I mean, you're probably what? gonna get a second round pick from. Just second round pick. I mean, you probably get the same. You probably can get the same thing you got for Christian McCaffrey. Probably not. You don't think so? No. I mean, he's, he's, he, somebody didn't pick him up. The Cowboys pick him up. I know that. Uh, but I mean, uh, maybe. the Panthers need a lot. I mean, the Panthers need a lot of help. I mean, the no, running the running back situation in, in Carolina is, is is real trash. I mean, the wide receivers, but they really need a line. You can't expect Bryce Young to do anything. He's giving up seven sacks. He's always on the ground. You're not getting any sacks. You're giving up all the sacks. You're not causing any turnovers. Of course, you don't get smashed by the Cowboys. But I mean, in this game, I mean, it can go either way. I honestly feel like Titans. You going Titans? What's, Titans. what's the spread? Did they tell you? It's uh, they're favored by three and a half. I wouldn't bet on this game, but I think the Titans are gonna win. You going Titans? Oh, man, I gotta go. I'm going Bryce Young, man. I gotta get Bryce. Like Bryce Young, gotta get another win. I can see the Panthers going two and nine. Uh, but moving on to the next game here, we have the four and six Tampa Bay Buccaneers going against the five and five. Indianapolis Colts. I mean, both teams. I mean, Trash. Tampa. We thought, you know, week one they went and beat Minnesota. Okay, mm-hmm. then they're playing pretty good, and now they suck. <laughs> <laughs> and then the Indianapolis Colts rookie quarterback doing his thing, didn't really protect himself. Or I mean, just his level of playing. You know, mm-hmm. it wasn't. It, he didn't take care of his body. But now he's probably gonna learn. He'll be back, Anthony Richardson. I mean, Jonathan Taylor's back. I mean, Col- Colts are favored of, by yeah. two and a half. I mean, honestly, the reason, only reason he lost to the 49ers is because of the defense. The, de- the uh, Baker Mayfield, he did decent. Well, he had two forty. He hit for two hundred forty-six uh, passing yards. I got bucks. 
yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going. Ooh, I'm, yeah, I'm going bucks in this game. They finna, they finna smash on the coast. I mean, I don't see, I don't see the quarterback for the for the uh, coast doing the same thing the 49ers did. I don't know. I mean, they give up 305 yards in the air. I don't see them doing that. They won't do that back to back games. And I mean, it's just. They just need I'm to, taking the Colts. You going what? I bet you lunch, Gavin. I got I got bucks. Bet on, on the it? Colts. Well, right now I'm up two. Because you paid off one Actually, of your no, three lunches. I'm not lunches. betting on Baker Mayfield. No, he doesn't deserve my coin. Come on, Baker Mayfield, the truth. If I can tease, I'll probably tease the Bucks. Don't tease me. Just shake me. <laughs> Let me see what other games they got. <laughs> All right, I'll shake on this man. I got you. We go. I'm going Coast, Bucks, baby. I'm going Bucks, man. Baker Mayfield for the ball. I stop playing. They not gonna lose back to back games. Y'all trying? Y'all trying to tap bait like they really trash. I mean, but uh, yeah. they are really trash. They not. I mean, Mike Evans for the ball out. I mean, five for four. Well, five for five for yeah, forty. Yeah, I got 42 bucks. yards. Oh, we finna. Oh, double bed. A double bed. I got bucks. I got bucks. Colts Nation, stand up. Ooh. So we're at the best day, so. Double bed right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's listen, Gavin. What do we? What do me and you got? We got um the Jags, Titan, Te Jags and Texans. Okay, Jags and Texans. We got that one. And uh, I gotta check on. The, I think Cowboys of Washington. I gotta check on that one again. The Cowboys of Washington. The Cowboys of Washington game. But I mean, I'm going. I'm going Tampa. I mean, even though Tom Brady ain't there, I mean. I still got We're doing in. this for pay. Yeah, We're I can doing. totally see the Bucks winning this game. Yeah, Guys, let us know you think it's gonna win this game. Exactly. Right? Moving Oops. on to the next game here. What we got? Ooh. Two and eight. New England Patriots going against the three and eight. Is this a is this a Super Bowl preview? <laughs> I mean, honestly, I could so totally see the Giants beating the uh, Patriots. Back-to-back this, back win? This could be Bill Belichick's last game. I mean, last year in New England. And you know the Giants. I mean, they, they want to stick it to him. I heard rumors that he may, be go, he may go to the Commanders. Patriot, the Patriots are favored by three. Yeah, I think you... Yeah, you think so? I heard. It. That's what it was. Command. He may be a coach for the Commanders next year. But I mean, I told you, man. This is a, Tommy, this is a tank off. Tommy DeVito, baby. I told y'all last week. He think, was going to win. He bought out. Listen here, man. He still got sacked nine times. So once again, it's not it's not the quarterback problem. It's, it's a just line. a line problem. Like how you get hit nine times. There's a lot of trash lines in the league. But this is horrible. I mean, Saquon had to do it all. He had what, 14 for 83? Yeah. Saquon freaking eight. He had a Herculean hey, what about, what effort. What about if Brady went? What about if Belichick went to uh, Las Vegas? Raiders? Yeah. Nah. What if Saquon go in with him? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, man, I mean, Josh Jacobs. I can see that. I mean, he ain't no Saquon, but I feel like they're gonna, you know, Josh Jacobs. They're gonna ride it out with him. They're gonna ride. Anyways, that pony. guys, let's get back on track. But back, um, so you, so you, so you, do you think if they win back to back games? I mean, it's gonna screw us up. Is that gonna? Is, it's gonna screw the job. But y'all need, after they get off, y'all need offensive line, and y'all don't need. Okay, it. but here's the thing, though. They can get an offensive lineman in the second round. It's, I'm not going O line first round. I'm getting want, a quarterback. You're not going. You're gonna give up a quarterback already when you know the, the line is the a problem. They're gonna get a lineman in the second round. We got Seattle second round Man. pick. We got two second round picks. I, We're gonna take care of the O line and maybe in free agency. That need to do. That need to spend all y'all picks on the line. I'm picking the Giants. Get, they get. But, but, but here's the thing though. We should lose this game, but we're probably going to win this game. Mm -hmm. and it's probably be the last game we win all year. Because then after that, we got the Packers and then the Saints Man, and then... Yeah, but I'm Giants just are winning out. I, I don't care. Long as Juju Smith suits to get a touchdown, because you already know last game he had one catch for nine yards. It's not going to happen. He's been a... What? But Dude, I mean, he sucks. <laughs> oh, man, but I mean, this I game... Mean, Tommy DeVito, man. Tommy DeVito. DeVito. Hometown kid. I'm, I'm, go, I'm going Giants this game. I'm going yeah, Giants. We should win this game. So who you got? Giants Nation. I mean, okay. Of course. I, and honestly, I'm going to watch this game. Ooh. You say you're going to start watching the game? Okay. 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 He's so, back. I gotta He's write back it out, for dude. DeVito. I got to write it out. I mean, he's decent. I mean, he ain't messed up last game. 18 for 26, 246 yards. Yeah, but touchdowns. that's a game. We, we need to lose, bro. We need to get a quarterback. You don't need no quarterback. You do. You need a you just line. No, cause even with the offensive line, you, you have to have a quarterback that makes good decisions. The zone doesn't that's make good decisions. What happened, what happened not the guy. Closest. Anyways, guys, let us know who you think is going to win this game. Down in the comments. We all got the Giants. Moving on. <laughs> I love you, Jay. Seven and three. Cleveland Browns going against the five and five Denver Broncos. Now, this game is 
This game's interesting because both teams are coming off pretty big wins. Freaking Broncos, jerks. Team, everyone seems to be buying in. Cleveland, I mean, it doesn't matter who the quarterback is. They don't need Watson. They're still getting these wins. <laughs> they need Watson. That was a lucky win. I mean, hey. They... <laughs> No, it, doesn't like much, it, doesn't get much easier. it doesn't get much easier, but hey, I got Cleveland in this game. What? I got Broncos in this game. First of all, how you gonna just Cleveland? Oh, we bet this one. Okay. Of course, you already know Russell Wilson's Throw been balling out. Uh, they beat the Vikings. What? Broncos two, two, are favored by two and a half. Touchdown? Exactly. I mean, they balling out. Coach. Coach. Well, no. Well, I, I'm gonna go with Cleveland's more balanced overall. They got. I mean, Amari Cooper is better than Cortland Sutton. Um, is he better than Jerry Judy? Yeah. It's way better than Judge Judy. And then, I mean, Cleveland's running game is better than Denver's running game. Cleveland's defense is better than. But it's the uh, Russell Denver's Wilson defense. effect. I, I think no Cleveland, Cleveland is going to give them problems. They got I'm Sierra on the sideline. I'm going Cleveland. I'm going Cleveland. <laughs> Cleveland, money line. I'm going Cleveland in this game. All right. And what did Russell you say? Wilson's barely scraped that win. Oh, he's going to do some scraping. What? Uh, a win is a win. It doesn't Who matter. If Cortland Sutton, Sutton wasn't athletic, that would have been picked. Who'd you pick, Jesse? I mean, when you when you when you trust in your wide receivers, that was you do. You you you, got, you drafted this wide receiver for a reason. You throw the ball up, they you gonna catch it. He did it. I'm calling that Coughlin. Exactly, man. We game managers gotta try and Russell Wilson like he ain't the goat, like he ain't win the ring for Seattle. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going Broncos. Oh, those Y'all bet on those rust days are well behind. Y'all bet on this? Are you, are you, you wanna bet on this? Yeah. I can bet you too. Hear me? The rust days, the rust days ain't over with yet. Hey, but guess what? Broncos I mean, country. He's good. Let's He's good. ride. You going Broncos? Yeah. Oh, see, look at that. I'm going Broncos. I got, I got Browns. You, got you want to bet on that, sir? You bet. Yeah, yeah sure. I'll bet. Long you want to double bet? Okay. Let's bet. Let's bet. Let's bet a salt grass meal. Salt Ooh. grass. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Now, what, uh, what's the place that we went for your B day? Longhorn. Longhorn meal. You just want the shrimps again with the nachos? Yeah, let's go. Right, he just going to shrimp with the nachos. Let us know going to win this game. I'm gonna cash in all my oh, bets on some trips and nachos. Moving on here, man. We got the next game. Who we got? I don't care. The three and five. I mean, not three and five. At three oh five, we got to go against the Los Angeles Rams. This the four and six. The four and six. Los Angeles Rams going against the two and nine Arizona Cardinals. Super Bowl preview. Yeah. Give me. Give me. Um, yeah. Right. Honestly, the Rams should win this game. Give me the Rams, yeah. Give me the Rams. Puka Nakua is just ridiculous. I understand. Uh, Demarcus Robinson, uh, Royce Fro- Cooper Cups out, but still. Yeah, he's out. Um, Kyler Murray. I mean, he's just coming back. I mean, he's just coming back. He finally lost. I mean, he won the first game back. He lost the second game. Might this- lose another one. Rams are favored by one. It's a close game. It's a close one. I got Rams. I'm gonna take Rams. You take a Rams? Ooh, you think? I mean, Matthew, you think Matthew Stafford going back to the old Detroit Lions, Matthew Stafford? It could be the problem. I mean, I, I got to go. They barely beat the Seahawks. They won the Seahawks by one. I'm I'm going Rams. I got to go. I'm going Rams also. So all three of us going Rams this game. I mean, I just can't see, I just can't see the Cardinals doing it. They they in the rebuilding stage. They're 2-9. They really don't have to win this game. But moving on, man, we got Ooh, my Eagles. Six and five. Buffalo Bills going against the nine and one Philadelphia Eagles. I mean, wait, we thought you were a cheesehead. Three twenty-five. Damn, this, damn, this game's gonna be good, bro. This is the shirt. I'm taking the Bills. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with the Eagles in this game. Exactly, man. You gotta go because with- because I still don't buy the Bills, Gavin. I don't buy them either, but I feel like but I think this team. I mean, Josh Allen, he's gonna throw at least two touchdown passes. I don't but know. We'll I, see. We'll I, see. I we'll like, see. I feel like the Bills need this game a I lot more not, than the Eagles. Do. I would not. I would not bet on this game, guys. If yeah. you're gonna bet, take the over. Do not yeah, the, bet. The, do not pick one specific team to bet because this game could go either way. I mean, look. Think about it. Buffalo got a new offense. Eagles are only favored by three and a half. Yeah. I mean, this game. This game could be very. They can't leave it close. If it's a close game, Eagles gonna win it for sure. But I'm, I'm gonna. Call, I'm gonna take the over. But I'm gonna go with. Give me uh, Bills plus seven. Whoa. Oh, yeah, of course. For sure. No, that's free. Jesse. 
That's robbery. Bills plus don't seven. Do don't do it. The Bills plus seven. See, every time you get me, you always give me all these plus. There's no way the Bills are losing more than seven points. I'm not betting on the Bills. Let's go. I'm oh, rocking yeah. with it. Bills plus seven. Locked in. Let's go. Like, Cause last time I last time I, he, we last time we bet the Miami Raider game. I'm telling you, Gavin. The bills, a, the bills screw you, dude. You're gonna be sick. They're coin sellers, dude. I don't bet on the Bills. I never bet on the Bills. They're coming <laughs> through I, this I, one I, time. I would have won eight hundred dollars when they played the Broncos. I learned my lesson bro. <laughs> back in 2021, right? That uh -huh. Monday night game when they were playing the Titans. Uh -huh. yeah. They were the they were the favorite. I would have won a rack, a rack. A rack, bro. Rack city, Shock my slip in. Shock my slip in. Took them in the um. Remember when they played the Chiefs? Yeah. That overtime in that game, double overtime. Shock my slip. Chocked I don't. I don't in. bet on the Bills, dude. The coin sellers. Yeah, we'll see what yeah, happens, dude, I'm, man. I'm, I'm fading I'm, the I'm Bills. I'm believing in Allen Magic. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go ahead and go with the uh, Eagles, but I'm fading the Bills. I'm just. You're fading the Bills on site. I'm not betting on them ever. I don't care who they play. I'll never put my coin on the Bills again. Only player props. That's it. But anyways, guys, next week's matchup. This week's matchup is the seven and three. Kansas City Chiefs going against the five and six Las Vegas Raiders. I mean, guys. Swifty Nation. Give, give me the give me the Chiefs in this game. Whatever the spread is. Patrick Mahomes is he's out for blood. I mean, that 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 drop by Nico Hardman was just a really bad oh my God. drop. Patrick Mahomes, I mean, went to the podium and still like was very positive. I mean, even that was gonna side, happen. It was gonna happen. The Eagles did get a little lucky. Not saying the Eagles Chiefs might, are, not, Chiefs not, are wait, favored. Wait, wait, hold on. Tell my Chiefs are favored by in the Eagles got lucky. Everybody knew you, everybody knew you from the drop that pass. No, I knew the Eagles were gonna win. But nah, you can't say that yes, everyone he, knew he's gonna drop he, that. Pass. Yes, he did, cause he's a body catcher. Everybody, even Shannon Sharp said it. Every time you see that dude catch the ball, he always catches with his body. And Gavin, you know, wide receivers that catch balls body with their body. body. Hey, and that's the, also the hardest hey, catch to catch hey, for a wide receiver over the head, a deep ball over the head, right? Hear me? So and that's you, also the stubbornness about the Kansas City Chiefs. I mean, they gotta go out and get some receivers. That's their fault. They they bet it all on Travis Kelsey, so they're gonna live and die by Travis Kelsey. And that's, that's the problem. Nice. But he hasn't really been dominating, right? Nah, he has. Uh, I mean, he hasn't been dominating like he's supposed to dominate. But he's a tight end. You shouldn't really expect that much from a tight end. Yeah, that's hard, dude. Y your receiver can't be your tight end. Yeah, your number, your top can't be your number one. Yeah. It's be good tight to have like a nice tight end, but you gotta also have like a like they should never got rid of Tyreek. True. That was this. They saying like this. Um, bro, that was so dirty. Right. Yeah, that connection was nasty. Yeah. They, should, they need another they need another fast wide receiver, another uh, go-to wide receiver. But they, I, they were able to win that that the Super Bowl, man. But uh -huh. I mean, they they know deep down like they they're not gonna win that many Super Bowls without them. Though. True. So how, who are you picking this game, Raiders or Chiefs? Oh, Chiefs, man. Chiefs, of course. That's what we all said. But I'm saying long term, like they're gonna have to get a receiver. Oh yeah, long term we have to get a receiver, of course. Uh, but moving on here, we got the next game. We have the. Ooh. We have the eight and three Baltimore Ravens going against Surprisingly. the four and six Los Angeles. How Chargers. are they winning these games and he barely scores touchdown passes? They They're cheat. running the ball, man. They're running the ball. It's just trash. I mean, by the I mean, no Mark Andrews. Uh -huh. Isaiah Lackley's got to step up. Um, Odell Beckham, I believe he got injured too. I don't know. Did he get injured? He's always injured now. He no, just... I thought he was back. I thought he was all right. Let me check. So. Guess what we got here? I mean, because the last time I seen him talk about Odell back in what he had, like, he had a touchdown and at least over 80 yards catch receiving. But there you go, right there. Questionable shoulder. Shoulder injury, yeah. This is not a leg injury. I go with that. Oh, yeah. Mark Andrews is out there. Uh, he's like their Tight top uh, target. Mm. He's like their Kelsey. See, I mean, this game is going to be a toss up because with the Chargers, I just can't trust the Chargers. Zay Flowers, hey, Zay Flowers got to step up, man. He's not a bad receiver, but he's got to get some more looks. I'm he can have a whole bunch of looks with this trash defense. You don't have to give him some more looks, man. This Chargers defense is just trash. Like, they, everybody's always injured. They yeah, can't. I got I Ravens in this game. I got Ravens in. <sighs> Even though the Chargers need to win this game. I hate the Ravens, I still got Ravens but they're going to win this game. This game could be a trap, though. No, I think last, oh, man, last game I bet Chargers and the Chargers lost. I'm going to Chargers this week. I'm not going with the Ravens. I refuse. This game, I'm, this game I'm can be a trap head against game. The wall. You think so? But I got Ravens. Ravens winning. are favored by three and a half. They need, all they need to do with all the Chargers need to do is just shut down the run, and they gonna win. Yeah, no Mark Andrews. He, 
That's too much. I mean, they were able to do that against the Bengals because the Bengals also didn't have their starting quarterback. True, so but they were able to take advantage of. Oh, and it's Monday night. This is a Monday night game. This is a my um. Go back. It's the twenty seventh. Yep, last one. Yes, yeah, last game. Damn, yeah. this is the Monday night game. <laughs> uh, I mean, it would have been, three I mean, and five Chicago Bears going against the six and five Vikings. I mean, look. This past week, Fields was back. I mean, DJ Moore and him, they're in sync. Uh-huh. They're in a very good position. They're going to go out and they're going to draft Marvin Harrison Jr. I can see that. That'd they don't be nice. need a quarterback. They're going to get another receiver. That dude's a stud. That's going to be ridiculous. But Joshua Dobbs, I mean, he did everything he could. Dobby. Um, I don't know if Justin Jefferson is coming back. I don't know when he's... Can you can you check? If, you, if Jefferson plays in this game, this is big for the Vikings. Yeah, but I mean, they're not able to run the football very well. They're not. I mean, I gotta, I gotta give it to the I mean, Bears. They got I mean, T.J. Hawkinson, but he was also questionable. But I think he plays. He's tough. Kirk Cousins gone. Isaiah Four gone. Dean Lauer, Noah Swell, Lucas Patrick. No, I don't see it. Yeah, I guess Hawkinson is taking off the um, injury. So he might, he might play. He might play this game, but I mean, with this one, play regardless. But with this one, who you got? Who you got winning? You got the Vikings, or I mean, do you believe the Bears can even win? Vikings are favored by three and a half. What does the Bears have to do to win this game? That's what that's what we want. I'm gonna say the Vikings are gonna win um, because yep. they're a better team and uh-huh. um, they're actually like really trying to like make the playoffs. Like, you think they're trying to push for the playoffs even even yeah. without Kirk Cousins and the number one wide receiver? Hell oh, yeah, they are. What's the point? Because they're in win now. They got their tight end. Win now. They got their two receivers. Okay. Adam Thielen was replaced by Jordan Addison. They hit on that. They replaced Stephon Diggs with Justin Jefferson. They hit on that. They traded for TJ Hawkinson to get the Pro Bowl tight end. They hit mm-hmm. on that. True. The only thing they don't have is a running game. They can get that in the draft. Who are they running back right now? Is um uh, Jordan Madison? Madison. Mad- I mean John- Alexander. Alexander Madison. My bad. Alexander Madison and Cam Makers. Cam Makers is not that guy. No, he's, he's not. out again with an Achilles injury. Um, Madison is just not the guy. I mean Dalvin Cook. I what mean is clearly that Ty Chandler. Not the guy anymore. But I mean the other running back. We gotta see, but I mean, hey, I'm. I guess all three of us going Vikings this game, but there you have it. Week twelve picks, NFL week twelve picks. Also, I need y'all to please, please, please to sign up for Prize Picks. Make sure you get the code P R A W W P Q J four. Man, and always remember, man, we dropping this episode every Wednesday night. We bringing it to you early. Yeah. We know you want to get on the picks. You know you want to know who's winning. Listen to us, man. We got the stats. We got everything you need. But it's your boy, Kodak Coughlin. And your boy, Real Good Doty. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's also going to be linked underneath the uh, description. description as well. And also follow me on Instagram, Real Good underscore Doty as well for daily motivation. But guys, I really appreciate y'all. And, and I didn't even introduce myself. Or intro, outro oh, myself. Introduce- Chico Grande, Chico two times shooter McGavin, baby. Watch out for a shooter gets on. He didn't give you no respect because you was still a fan. Check us out on uh, Instagram. All the links in the description. We got a podcast, NFL picks, NBA show coming, clip channel, gaming channel, our reaction page. Just hit 7K subs. Get it to 8K subs. Let's go, baby. And guys, last but not least, you ladies out there too. Have a happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy some good food. Eat that some turkey. Family, some good conversation. Eating that stupid. Also enjoy some good football as well, and some college football, and some basketball. Oh yeah, and some bare knuckle boxing and oh, bare knuckle sport, boxing. Whatever sports you like, but guys, mainly football. Definitely, definitely. Mainly, just 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 play with the pigskin, baby. <laughs> just play with the pigskin a little bit. Oh uh, man, but you already know, man. It's your boys, man. It's TFTC Sports Week Twelve. We can't wait to see y'all Week Thirteen. Stay tuned. We will see y'all next week, baby.